Howdy folks, I'm here in the woods with my chalkboard again to answer a very pressing question, which is, how do we prove that the power set of A intersect B is equal to the intersection of their power sets? And it's just like your typical set equality proof. All we have to do is show that the power set of A intersect B is a subset of the intersection of the power sets. And then we've got to show that the power set of A intersected with the power set of B is a subset of the power set of their intersection. This is one of those nice set equality proofs where once we write one subset proof, the other subset proof is actually just that one backwards, which will save us some space on the chalkboard, less writing for me, so should be good. So let's just prove that the power set of A intersect B is a subset of the intersection of the power set of A and the power set of B. To do that, of course, we have to begin with an element of the power set of A intersect B, and then we want to show that it's in here. So we'll say if, if X is an element of the power set of A intersect B, then what? Well, as usual, this is going to be a pretty straightforward just application of definitions. So I certainly uh, encourage you to give it a try yourself. If X is an element of the power set of A intersect B, well, that would mean that X is a subset of A intersect B by definition of power set. So this means X is a subset of A intersect B. So that means every element of X is in A and every element of X is in B, which would mean that X is a subset of A. So we could write that here. X is a subset of A and X is a subset of B. Ah, now you see we're getting close. X is a subset of A, so what can we conclude? Well, by definition, that means that X is an element of the power set of A, since the power set of A just contains all the subsets of A. Similarly, since X is a subset of B, we can conclude, whoops, that X is an element of the power set of B. So X is in the power set of A, X is in the power set of B, thus it's in their intersection. X is an element of the power set of A intersected, now my chalk broke, intersected with the power set of B. And so we've proven that any element of the power set of A intersect B is also an element of the intersection of power set of A and power set of B. Thus, by definition of subset, the power set of A intersect B is a subset of the power set of A intersected with the power set of B. Sorry for a bit of sloppy writing there at the end. So all that remains for this set equality proof is to prove that this is a subset of this. Like I said, we can just do this going backwards. Maybe you could cover the screen now and try to do that yourself. I'll narrate you through it anyways. We would just begin with an arbitrary element of the power set of A intersected with the power set of B. Then being an element of that intersection, means that X is an element of the power set of B over here, and X is an element of the power set of A. Then we apply the definition of power set to conclude that X must be a subset of A and X must be a subset of B, since it's in both of their power sets. But if X is a subset of A and X is a subset of B, that would mean X is a subset of their intersection. And then by definition, X is an element of the power set of the intersection. And so we would have proven that the power set of A intersected with the power set of B is a subset of the power set of A intersect B. Thus, the power set of A intersect B equals the power set of A intersected with the power set of B. Hope this was helpful and thanks for watching. I was chilling out here in the woods and then I realized, what am I doing? I'm not supposed to do that. I'm just supposed to do math. <laughs>